will show you how to calibrate the transmitter with Minipix on Vision Planner. Here are all the devices we need. Video Link Flight Controller Minipix. Minipix Receiver Connect Cable. Video Link Transmitter 89 Pro. Video Link Receiver R12 DSM. A computer and a USB cable. First, connect Minipix with the receiver. Plug one end of the cable to Minipix RC in. And plug the other end to the receiver. Make sure the polarity is not reversed. The black cable here means GND. Second, connect Minipix to the computer with USB cable. Yellow light on Minipix flashes means the self check is complete. Third, bind and set the data on the transmitter. Power on the transmitter. You can see there is a signal tower because I have already finished bending between the receiver and the transmitter. The purple light of R12DSM means sparse signal output. The receiver should support sparse or PPM signal output. Otherwise, many pigs cannot recognize the signal on the receiver. Minipix has already installed firmware of multi-rotor, so choose model type on the transmitter. Enter the basic menu. Model type. Choose multi-rotor. Long press push push button to and push it once again to confirm. Then make sure the throttle is reversed. Go to reverse. Throttle. Set throttle from normal to reverse. Because R12DSM is a 12 channel receiver, so I need to set the channel system and set the channel from 10 channel to 12 channel. Fourth, calibrate the transmitter on mission planner, open mission planner. Choose the right port. COM3. Connect. The connection succeed. Click Hardware Config. Mandatory Hardware. Radio Calibration. Caliber Radio. Okay. Okay. Move all sticks and the switches to their extreme position. Check, check if the movement of the bar is corresponding to each to each channel. If it's not corresponding to the channel, change the direction of the channel owner transmitter. After that, click when done. Okay. Okay. So the calibration is complete. That's all about how to calibrate a transmitter with mini picks.